So... I'm gonna play this game. I f remember downloading once, but completely forgot what this is about. I think this is a horror game, but... I don't know. And of course there's this like... <laughs> uh, I don't know how to get rid of that. I'm not even gonna try to. Delta Academy of the Arts something at 3 something. So it looks like we're a student. Oh. So this animation. And digital arts department. Please don't stare at the camera. My name is Anne. I'm a freshman student at Delta Academy of Arts, majoring in the did blech. I love stuttering. My class has ended for the day, but I found myself returning to the campus as I left my USB flash drive at school. Oof. Tutorial movement interaction menu run. You can save your progress at any point in the game by going to the save in the menu. Save often and make separate save files if you are going for multiple endings. You can adjust the volume and other settings of the game in the options. Welcome to the Delta Academy of the Arts. Exhibition hall is always open for public viewing. We hope you enjoy your visits. Opening hours 8 a.m. to 9 p.m. We are closed on public holidays. Halloween party, Campus One on October 20. October 20. How did I? Ah, missing Charles Worth, missing Mira Hess, and missing Hannah Itagaki. Oof. Digital arts department. Guess I need to head to floor five then. Let's use function. Yeah, what's up? Don't mind me. I'm just waiting for my friend. Can I just use the elevator to go? I think that's my objective. Can I just... Men's restroom. Women's restroom. I don't need to use it at the moment. Can't enter the restroom at the moment. There you're soon. Far left. Okay. Hey Anne, what brings you back up here? I left my USB drive up here like an idiot. So, uh, where's my. Ah! Uh, there's my stuff. I need to go the complete other way. Okay. <coughs> <coughs> Take the USB flash drive. Nice. There's some time left before the school day ends. <coughs> <coughs> And here I got, and here I thought I got better. Uh, I can do some work before I go home. Why? <coughs> you wanted to go home early for a reason. Why? Why you decide to stay longer? You grab the USB. You just need to head out. Well, then again, I guess it's not like I don't understand the feeling, but uh, ugly f bald guy in thing. All clear. <laughs> Better get out of here. Yeah. I didn't even bother to talk to other students. I just went straight for the USB drive. Probably should have explored a little bit more, but oh well. There goes me. Friday, 21st of August, slide 20. <coughs> oh no. It's already midnight. So we passed the school closing hours. I'm so screwed. Weird. No signal. <coughs> <coughs> Why is there no signal? Never mind. I should head out first. Yeah, this is gonna be a horror game. Yep, I figured. 
Ah, I hate horror games. I am never- I scream too much when I play them. This game has an odyssey feature. Use it to continue f from where you left off after encountering an untimely demise. So... Ah. What happened to the school? I don't know, but time to find the way out! <coughs> I will literally bust through the fucking window. It's locked. I don't remember locking it. What's going on? Fuck. I, I just wanted to jump out the window. That would have been the easier way out. Mira has. Yep, everyone here is gone. Young man. Charles Worth. It's a sinister painting. There's a small below. H Hannah? Anne. Why you gotta do this to me? Fuck! Fuck no! 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 Oh, okay. Did. I just ran right through. Okay. So. Wait, where's the girl in the painting? I don't know. I don't know. Someone's knocking at the window. Oh yeah, no. Nah. What the fuck? <laughs> Chapter 1. I'm not going back. I'm not going back. Fuck that. I'm not going back. I'm running. Bye! A piano. How neat. A pod plant. A piano. Is that a play itself, huh? Ah! Oh! God damn it! Why am I doing this to myself? I'm sick as fuck. <laughs> uh. The part line. People have blank composed their own blank. Music sheets blank to be submitted blank. File grades will be blank upon blank. No words are missing. Oh, so this is unlocked, huh? Sheet music. I wonder... So if I just instead of avoid that. Same piano key, nice, right? No, I'm not going. You know what? That's fair. Uh. Another piano key. Hey, that's mine. Where do you think you're going? What? Thief? What the fuck? Are you? What the fuck is that? Okay. Okay. That's a piano. Why is there just a piano bl cock blocking the hallway? Okay, so I assume there's a maze, but... Okay. <gasps> what the fuck? No, 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 no! Shit. Let's go. Let's go. I'm out. Why are there pianos? I hate pianos. Every single- No, I got chased. Last time I checked the goddamn piano and out only. I got- Fuck. I got screwed over and I screamed so much. 
I, this is PTSD. Huh? No. No. Right? Excellent. That's a piano. Some piano keys are missing. I have most of them. What? Uh. Get the f I will climb over you. Who are you? Nice eyes! Your eyes are very pretty. Maybe I need to slow down this part. Yeah, this part is tricky. Hello? Oh, hello. Sorry, I'm quite busy right now. Um, I mean, I can see that, kinda. Hey, you shouldn't be here. Yeah, I shouldn't. Please leave me the way out. And by that, I don't mean the afterlife. Oh no. Oh no. Did you remain in the school after 9pm? Yep. I fell asleep. You shouldn't have done that. Anyway, I am Mira Hess. I was a student from the piano department. Listen, I know you're confused about what's going on at the school, but you need to get out of here. Now. Exit this room. Turn left. And go down the stairs. There's a piano be blocking the way? Huh. That's weird. There should be nothing there. I have heard this music before. No, I have not. Huh? What do you mean? This is the music I was playing in the exhibition hall. I didn't go to the exhibition hall. Impossible. This is my original work. I composed it. But before I could submit it, I was trapped here. Oh, so there's a little thief in the school, huh? Wait... Unless... Ivy... Right... I... I knew it... That bitch... I... I understand... Now... That day... Before I was trapped here... She drugged me... And... She stole it. Oh, um. I'll help you get revenge if you help me get out. Hi, Hess! How you doing? You look... happy. Got that smile. What the fuck? What the What the fuck? Huh? 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 There is no way out. Mi uh, Mira, Mira, Mira. Are you kidding me? Okay, so can I just? No, I can't. Okay. You motherfucker! Okay, so it's just gonna... 
do that. I'm tired time, huh? Okay. Okay, that also kills me. How do I get out? Okay, so do I just have to survive? Like that? Okay, well this is gonna take a while, isn't it? Okay. What the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? Okay. I should have made a separate save file. Here. It's it's what? And I walked right into that. God damn it. Nice smile. My work made it an exhibition. Oh well. Well, <coughs> I lived. To whoever's reading this, keep calm, don't panic. I'm a security guard working for this school. Just stay exactly in place where you found this letter and yell security cells again. I will come to you and help you get out. I think I will not. Oh shit, please don't be a threat. Okay, you look like a normal human. Your eyes are a bit blank, but I suppose. High security, man. Huh? Oh no. Hey, wait! Calm down. I'm a human, just like you. You're not one of them, right? I'm a security guard working for the school. I can help you to get it. I can help you to get out safely. Can you? That'd be great if you're trustworthy, right? <coughs> I see. Hmm. And was it? All right. Where do I begin? I know this sounds crazy, but the school is cursed. I think it's a bit obvious when there were floating pianos trying to murder me and some creepy girl who has lost her face. Along with some other girl at the window. Every night, the school will transform into this nightmare that we are experiencing right now. Oh gee, the layout of the school randomly changes every night. Unexplained things happen to each of the school's departments. Have you seen those moving pianos? There are more of those on the lower floors ahead of us. Moving pianos are more creepy stuff in general. You must be wondering how and right. why, right? I'm afraid I'm just as clueless as you are. <coughs> Protect the students in the school's reputation. The principal kept this place a secret. Well, that explains quite a lot. That ugly motherfucker. Principal? Yes, he knew about this. In fact, we are investigating it together. Oh. And uh, I'm assuming that none of you both know what the hell you're doing and... I would rather- can you guys like call an exorcist or something? Surely they couldn't be too expensive. You knew about the 9pm rule, right? That rule is made precisely for this reason. Well, great. And if something were to happen to you or if you lost your way in this place, well, you would become a permanent resident of this school. Anyway, the school always returns to its normal state when morning approaches. Everything returns to normal as if nothing happened. Well, that's the gist of it, I guess. 
That being said, we should really get moving now. If you have any more questions, I'll answer them along the way. For now, let's find a way out of this place. Hmm? What is it, Anne? On the paper. Yes, that is mine. I made lots of those and I scattered them around school. There are at least one or two in each apartment of the school. The school changes the layout every night, so the position of the paper may be different from day to day. What? I didn't find any copies of the paper in the piano department? That's odd. What's your name? Hmm? My name? Look, my name is not important. Your name is not important, so you can just give it to me. Just call me security or security guard like everyone else, okay? Well, that's not sus. Why don't we just wait until it's morning? I know. Let's just hide and wait till morning. Yes, you could do that, but trust me, it's hard to just get out of school as soon as possible. Why? Well, there's a dangerous entity that roams around the school. Uh, of course there is. A girl. We have to keep moving to avoid meeting her. Staying in one spot is a bad idea. Well, I think I already met her. Besides, there are no good hiding sets and everything is alive enough to get you. Even the floor? How long has this been going on? Hmm, I'm not sure. <coughs> it's been a while, but I don't know when exactly. You might want to ask the principal about that. If the fucker's willing to answer. Oh, this shit was confidential until I got involved. <coughs> After we get out safely, that is. Well, that's great. Well, let's keep going. Chapter 2. Sculpting Department. Oh, that's even great. The sculpting department. You know, the sh stuff with the creepy faces, you know. Yeah, a clay statue. Another clay statue. Another clay statue. <laughs> ah! Uh -huh. She's following us. <laughs> I'm fucked. Oh, before we proceed, there are some statues running around this floor. They are not friendly, so make sure to keep away from them. <sighs> okay, well, gee. Pow Clay. That's. Yep, I figured that was a trap, but I still had to check. Don't walk on the spots of blood, they're there for a reason. Set you without a body. Leave me alone. Hey, can you let us through? We need to get to the second floor. No, go away. Well, that's great. Um, door's locked. There's no written on the door. Success. It's a room behind us. Yep, let's do that. Huh. The sculpture is blocking our way. Alright, and I can push it out of the way. Leave all the heavy duty work to me. Well, I fucked up. I understand the puzzle. Guess that's that. <sighs> you gotta be kidding me. Clay key. I don't want to cock block my own way, please. Reuse the key to unlock the door.
Final year project for sculpting department. Theme success. Type of clay blank, minimum sizes, final grades will be fucked upon fucked. Some of the words are missing. Key to success are hands, legs, body, slash legs. What does that mean? Hands, hands, legs, bodies, and heads. In this room or outside? So there's one head. I guess that technically counts as four heads. There's one hand. So, uh... Six legs. Six leg beast, four heads, one hand. Six legs, four heads. So then I guess... I'm gonna have to brute force the bodies part? Unless that's the only one that's zero. Ah! Finally! I'm an idiot. What's that? I should have checked this everything else. Oh, Mr. Security. Are you still patrolling the halls? How are you? It's been a while, hasn't it? I am fine. Listen, I need to go to the second floor, but the way is blocked by your friend. A pile of junk. Is there anything we can do to convince him to move? Oh, him. Please don't call him a pile of junk. He also wants a beautiful statue. If only you knew the story of what happened to him. Anyway, I think you'll be able to convince him to move if you fix him up. He's in pretty bad shape after all. You can take the sculpting tool and fix him up with some clay. You can get clay from some of the clay piles lying around this room. Good luck! Clay statue. Another clay statue. One clay. Two clay. Three clay. That should just be enough. What are you doing? Here's some clay. We're gonna fix you up. Stay still. Huh? No, leave me alone. I don't need to be fixed. Sheesh. Stay still, will you? Man, I need some help here. There's a reason why my creator called me a failure. Don't even try to fix me. I said... Huh? Leave. Me. Alone. <coughs> oh, come on. Why the cutscene? Failure. Sculpting apartment. Please don't chase me. Please don't chase me. I do not want to be chased. Yep. Yeet! Why are there just pieces here? No! Oh, I thought I could push it. I thought I could push it. I thought I could. Ah, oh, no. Oh, shit. Well, I mean, what else am I supposed to do?
Haha. <laughs> Dude, cock blocked. Sucker. Whew. Put things where they previously belonged. It's what you call victory. <sighs> yeah, but how? Sucker. <sighs> Move, you motherfucker. Okay, that fucker removed real fast, huh? Looks like that thing is no longer chasing us. <coughs> <coughs> Hmm? And are you okay? I do not think so now. Yes, I am tired too. Let's rest for a bit, okay? <sighs> what do you mean by all of them? Yes, you heard me. She failed all of them. Every single subject. Oh god. How is that even possible? Because school is a failure? They don't test you on properly on what you learn, nor do they teach you anything properly? If you paid more attention to her, maybe you would have known. Paid more attention? Do you think I had the time for that? Blame game. I'm the one with the job, working hard for this family. Without me, both of you would have rotted in the streets. Your job is to take care of her. Oh great, here we go again. You're the one who's home all the time. You can't bother to help her with her studies. You think you never tried? You know our daughter is different. I told you to send her to the special needs school, but you didn't listen. Uh, special needs ain't a good place either. For the millionth time, there's nothing wrong with her. She's just a slow learner. Uh, that's even worse. Not giving her the help she needs if she has... Oh boy. See? Exactly what I said earlier. If you paid more attention to her, then you would have known that there's something wrong with her. Why don't you just admit you are bad at parenting? Uh. Oh, your responsibility. How dare you listen her. You can still hear the screams no matter how hard you cover your ears. That's just something you learn in a household like that. You can't cover your ears up from the truth and whatever goes around you. You're ignoring the problem. The problem's just there. You can't pretend it doesn't exist. God, it sucks. I am leaving. She is all yours. I don't care what you want to do with her. I don't want to take care of her either. I'm done with both of you. Oh, fuck, man. I'm leaving too. Mm. Send her to your relatives or whatever. My family wants nothing to do with her. Oh, Jesus. I'd rather send her to the orphanage. <sighs> Bro. Hey. You are awake. What's wrong? Didn't get enough sleep? You look pale. Are you okay? If you need more rest, please say so. Don't force yourself. Man, I promise I'll get you out of here. So please don't worry too much, okay? Yep, let's go, Anne. Uh. Oh, well, you're Travis as a security guard. <coughs> why do I work? Why do I decide to keep working as a security guard despite everything that's going on with the school? <coughs> I'm wondering that honestly. Yeah. Well, the principal has employed me to be a failsafe in case any students break the school rules and remain in school after midnight. 
Shots are very slim, but yeah. And here you are. You have to make sure that anyone who ends up here gets out safely. Besides, there's no way that I can just ignore everything that's been going on, right? Is there anything else I need to know? Oh, right. And there's something I forgot to tell you. Uh, you see... Time works differently in this place. I'm not entirely sure, but from my observations while patrolling this place, I can safely assume that it changes from day to day. There was one day where it took just an hour for morning to come, and another one took 20, 48 hours. It was a horrible experience. So, if we are lucky, maybe morning will arrive soon. Anyway, we still have to find an exit in case the worst case scenario happens. Yeah, what's the worst case scenario, exactly? Huh? What are you doing, man? Why are you haunting us? The fashion department. I'm not sure if the developers, int the developer intended me to just push the chess piece back and cock block the statue, but I did that. A sewing machine, probably some fabrics and stuff. Another sink. Uh, a mannequin. Where did it move? I think it moved. I think it moved. And I have a bad feeling about this. Let's keep moving. I'm not willing to go back. Well, I think I'll end the video here so I'm gonna have a reasonable amount of time to edit this video. Ah, oh, God. I hate horror games because I'm so bad at them. But uh, thank you all so much for watching me suffer and I'll. <coughs> See you in the next video. Why? It's not even COVID. It's just a viral infection. I don't even know why. I'm just suffering, man. <coughs> <coughs>